It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. That's aggressive. That's the only words I know. Good morning. Oh my goodness. So I kind of wanted to show you guys before I hopped into the shower and washed my hair, my insane hair. This is what happens like when I just leave it and I don't blow dry it, when I don't straighten it or curl it. I just let my hair loose. This is what happens. I don't even know if you want to call it curly. Honestly, oh my God. It's, it's cray cray. Anyways, so this is why like you see me a lot of the times with my hair up or whatever when I don't have time to like actually do it. It's mostly like up in a bun, ponytail or in a hat because my hair is insane. It's crazy. Honestly, if I would love to be able to wear my hair natural like this, but um, maybe more like have it more under control because this is just crazy. Like, this is insane. Like, I stuck my finger in a socket. One hour later. Okay, much better. Oh my goodness. And it feels much better. It feels healthier. I just feel better. Anyways, time to get started with our day. Look at these two. All comfy on the couch. He's so cute. Oh my goodness, like a little ball. Little fuzzball. And then there's big fuzzball. Oh, you hear me, don't you? All right, you guys, I just blow dried my hair a little bit just to dry it because um, it's cold outside. It's very cold outside. So I didn't want to walk outside with wet hair because that would be pretty cray cray. I'm not gonna put on makeup. I've actually been trying, as you guys probably know if you watch my vlogs, I've been trying not to wear as much makeup um, just to help my face because I would wear makeup every single day and it's just, been really harsh on my skin so i've been trying to like if there's just a day where i can just go without it i'm gonna go without it so today's one of those days where i can just go without it i don't need it I'm not going anywhere like important or anything so i do have to run a quick errand though real quick i don't have to like rush or anything because i don't have the kids today so it shouldn't be that stressful this guy right here has been super attached to me most of the day. I think it's because Haley's not here today, so he thinks of me as his mama while she's gone, I guess. I don't know. My friend stopped by and dropped me off an engagement present. She meant to give it to me during the engagement party, but it's literally been this long since she's been able to get it to me. We've just been super busy. She's been busy, I've been busy, and then we've crossed paths, but then we forgot about it, so we finally made it happen today, and she brought me an Instapot OMG. I am super excited about this thing, you guys. You have no idea. Have I ever used one? No, I have not, but it comes with instructions and a recipe book and all the things I need to know about it, and I've just heard really great things about it. So I do know you have to be very careful when you're cooking with it, but especially when you have kids, but seriously, it's gonna be super easy because literally you just take this out right here and wash it. I mean, it's so easy. I'm just so excited. You have no idea. All right, so I was just literally in 7-Eleven, obviously. I was in literally in the middle of filling my cup at the fountain drink place and this guy boy I'm not even gonna say man cuz he was incredibly rude literally pushed me out of the way making me spill my drink on my hand to refill his cup and I 
stood there with my hands soaking wet holding my cup and I was like excuse you and he didn't even like acknowledge me and the guy next to me was like what the man like you just shoved her out of the way and then he just walks away drinking his sipping his drink like no cares whatsoever I'm like I was right there and I, he wasn't blind and there was a bunch of people in there everyone was waiting in line like rude as F I was just like super annoyed like have some freaking manners for real like all of us have places to go people to see like you're not the only one with an agenda like let's get real now grow up holy cow all right ran over good god oh my goodness you guys guess what came in the mail ah. you have no idea what it is but i'll give you a little sneak peek These are our save the date magnets that we are getting to send out to people to save the date. And I'm super excited. They turned out really cute. So <sighs> I need to get all of that done and sent out. And then our invitations are in the mail. We ordered those as well only because there was this huge Black Friday sale thing going on and we literally got like 60 to 70 percent off it was insane like we got them for a good good deal so we went ahead and ordered the save the dates and the wedding invitations so the wedding invitations won't be sent out for a while but i'm gonna go ahead and send out these save the dates and get that taken care of and i just picked up my handsome little boy i'm so excited see him because I missed him while he was gone because he's my baby Mwah. sucking his thumb like a baby <laughs> <laughs> Jax wants some love too <laughs> Really? Yeah. How lucky are you? You found a candy with two, with two of them in it. <laughs> You're so lucky. But how how do they have two? I don't know. You just got lucky, man. <laughs> I also forgot to show you guys the finished product on Haley's uh, shelves that she was doing yesterday. Here they are. They are looking super cute on this wall and I told her I would wait for her to get things to put inside them. Like we're gonna get little like greenery plants or something cute to put in them but I told her I'll wait for her. But today is their dad's day so they will be spending the day with their dad. And I'm supposed to go to a meeting later at Haley's school to discuss her moving up to middle school next year and I am like super nervous about it but I know she'll do perfectly fine but I'm still like I don't know it's gonna be weird having a middle schooler she'll be in seventh grade I will have a seventh grader how insane is that just to say it it's just weird I feel old strong muscles Woo! Oh my goodness gracious. Let me see. Oh, you look so strong. Hey, you want to show them your felt tree? You want to show them? No, it's not my tree. Oh, it's not? It's all of our tree. It's all of your guys' tree? Like kids. Yeah. You. Want to show them how it works? Go ahead. I don't know. You can just take these off and rearrange them however you want. You put one one like here. Yeah, that looks good. Where we then put this and one? you got presents at the bottom, and you put the star on top, and Kesley put the hearts right here. No, I put this one and this one on. Oh, you did? Yeah, Kesley oh. me. She did? That was nice of her. What? I was picking out Christmas socks, so I was singing. I know you were singing. I was trying to catch you singing. Oh, oh, oh. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. 
That's aggressive. That's the only words I know. <laughs> hey, buddy. You want to help me in the vlog? Do you remember how to do it? Because you haven't done it in a while. Uh, Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm. Don't forget mm -hmm. to subscribe mm -hmm. down below. <laughs> and we'll see you later.